Yeah, thank, thank you, Professor Kelly. I mean, uh, it's, it's, it's a real honor to, to have someone like you, um, who's, who's a master of, uh, of Christ's uh, College, uh, a place where Darwin went and studied, I believe. Right? Yes, so, yes, Darwin so, was one of the undergraduates. So, so, so it's, it's, it's quite an honor, and also quite an honor because all my friends, uh, 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 Dr. Hamid, uh, went to your... Yes, yes, Dr. Hamid. Um, uh, Milton, the poet, went there too. Yes. But I have to say that many members of the public think our most famous graduate was Sasha Baron Cohen. <laughs> <laughs> so what, what do you think of uh, the Wings of Hope uh, Achievement Award? Well, as you know, today is the first time I've been here as a judge, and I have been overwhelmed by the quality of the presentations and by the standard of the projects that the, that the students have done. It's been really quite amazing. It's very, the effect that they've had on their communities uh, is, is remarkable, but also the effect it's had on them. You can see that the way that they've grown through the course of doing the project. And then the last presentation we had where we saw people that had been through it five or six years ago and are now making proposals for uh, graduate level uh, interventions in Malawi to help schools. Um, you, you can see that a, that, that a spark has lit something in them at that early age that's going to stay with them for the rest of their lives. You know, as, as, we, as we say in business, uh, uh, you know, product, uh, if it has to be sustainable, has to be good. And if, be good. if somebody yes. buys the same product for four or five years, it has to be good. And I'm glad that Wings of Hope uh, and the Wings of Hope Achievement Award has been sustainable because that's what we tried to do. So one of the things I thought was very remarkable was the, num the number of uh, past students that were back helping. Yes. And, uh, because first of all, they know how challenging these projects can be for people in year 10 or 11 or 12. And these are not difficult. You're asking them to do quite... The group that had gone to the top of Kinder Scout with snow yes. and cat, yes. I mean, yes. what a task. Yes. Yes. And for them to have done that. Yes. So uh, the, the encouragement that's given by past uh, graduates of the program who yes. come back yes. and uh, help and inspire the, the younger generation. That's one aspect of sustainability that, yes. that, uh, yes. uh, that, that, that allows it to flourish. So, yeah. No, I, I'm, I'm, I'm actually quite honoured because we get a, a wide variety of students from, from private schools to state schools, from failing uh, schools. And what we find is the students, when they go through Wings of Hope, they come out as a different individual, yes. uh, both yes. as an individual, yes. as also a team member. And that's something which uh, we are so grateful for all the patrons, all the supporters, because they have given so much with our workshops mm -hmm. that we mm -hmm. have with the students. And I think uh, we did a workshop at, at your, 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 mm -hmm. your college also, I mm -hmm. think uh, Rajni yes. came and uh, brought yes. a bunch of yes. students. So, so, uh, so there was a group there, uh, they've said some very memorable things, I wrote down some of them just so that I can read them later myself to remind my, myself of them. But one of the groups there that dis they were discussing teamwork and just spontaneously said, we, you know, we realized that when something went wrong, we didn't blame anyone. We just worked out how to solve the problem and yes. move on. Yes. And I, you know, so many little life lessons like that that, that, that I didn't learn until rather later in life. Yes. Uh, I, I, I could see there in, in, in very young people. Uh, it's yes. changed then. It's yes. changed then. Yes. Yeah. And I, I think this is probably one of the things that uh, I, I, I tell people, the fact that this country uh, has to evolve uh, with the changing circumstances, with uh, the geopolitical mm -hmm. situation, where you have the the rising, you know, India, China, and Brazil's of, of the world, and with the resources that we have, it's it's our human resources which has to really be, you know, slick. That's right. And, and that's that's that's, that's where yes. you need to have, you know, the the students really rising up to the occasion of challenging the students. Uh, from Singapore, for example, who really spend a lot of money and time on their students, yes. and uh, you know, in a small way, Wings of Hope does, uh, you know, try and get get there. Mm. Uh, That's right. So if I, if I think uh, at, at, in the university in Cambridge or in my college, when we're interviewing people, then high academic performance is important. Uh, they're going to struggle with the the, uh, the courses that they do if, uh, if, they're, if they're not uh, at that level. But what we really need as well is that kind of depth of maturity that. That these programs provide, that they've, that people know how to relate to each other. They, 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 they have self knowledge, so that when things go wrong, they're not completely set back. They can uh, work out, get over it, and move on. Uh, yes. That that kind of uh, self knowledge is important. Yes. And, uh, and uh, I have to say, I have to say, just to repeat again, and I'm just repeating myself here, but the the the, the quality of some of those uh, students that you see there, yes. um, their ability to get things done, and I, and and also the kind of um, 
amazement in their voices and their presentations that they didn't realize they could do that. Yes. And now they do realize they yes. could do it. Yes. And you just wonder what they're going to do next. You know? Go to Cambridge. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. I hope so. Thank you.